You can find satellite positioning systems in planes, cars, and even phones. They have become an essential tool in many people's lives, but they can be off the mark. There's a new system being developed in Japan to create a higher standard for accuracy. NHK World's Akane Nakajima reports. Fall brings the rice harvest to Hokkaido. Work is going smoothly, but there's no driver in sight. A satellite controls the harvester to centimeter accuracy. About 36,000 kilometers above Earth, the Michibiki satellite orbits as a part of Japan's first homegrown satellite positioning system. Most countries rely on the Global Positioning System, or GPS. But some factors cause GPS data to lose its accuracy on its journey to ground receivers. Two of these are the shift of the satellites out of their orbits and a delay in the signal caused by the ionosphere. They can be off by as much as 10 meters. The Michibiki system sends collection data and reduces the error to centimeters. Michibiki system achieved positioning at the level of accuracy. The key was producing the most accurate correction data as possible. This is the heart of the system at Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency. Correction data is being collected and sent to the Michibiki satellite. Unique algorithm is used to calculate factors that influence the GPS accuracy. Data is then produced to decrease the positioning errors. Improved accuracy creates new opportunities. One example is using robots for agricultural work. A group led by Hokkaido University professor Noboru Noguchi aims to become the world's first team to completely automate farming. GPS systems for farming are already used in places such as North America and Europe. Unlike this harvester with the Michibiki system, a driver has to be in the vehicle with the current system for safety and to turn the machine. The accuracy of the Michibiki system allows the vehicle to make turns by itself. The harvester mows precisely along the edge. With Japan's highly advanced farming technology using the Michibiki system, it would be possible for one person to control multiple machines. Essentially, I envision building an extremely efficient and effective robot-operated farming system. That's my blueprint for the future of farming. Beyond farming, research is underway to figure out exactly which fields this technology could transform. Kane Nakajima, NHK World, Tsukuba, Japan.